Good morning. So I'm here. Um, my daughter actually has been stricken with the flu. And um, the good thing about being an oil person is that the second I posted a picture of my homemade matzo ball soup, which is brewing over there, all my oil folks, this amazing community of um, healthy, like-minded people who have become friends, start to text me, vitamin D, thieves, oregano, raindrop treatment, peppermint on the feet. Um, so I just wanted to share with you what I'm doing and kind of, I'm gonna watch this process because I'm always uh, fascinated and I'm always amazed and impressed with um, how I've been able to turn to essential oils to support every uh, aspect of my life and wellness. And so this is gonna be our trial run with Julia's flu. So one thing I wanted to share with you that in addition to the oils that I make, so I have my vitamin D here um, and I have thieves going in the diffuser over there. Let's see if you can see that. Yeah, that's the thieves. There's all my oils right there and my yoga bobblehead that somebody made for me. It's actually me. My little altars, I always have little altars everywhere in my house. Um, so for now, um, I want to share with you this amazing recipe. I went away to an Ayurvedic retreat, actually at Korpalu. I wasn't planning to wear this shirt, but I went for a Pancha Karma, which is a one week Ayurvedic cleanse. And um, one of the things that I took from that, that was years ago, but was this drink that they would give to us before every meal. And right now it's in a solid form, but I'm gonna show you how to make it. It is made of three ingredients, lemons, ginger, and honey. Um, so actually it's equal parts uh, lemon and honey. So you squeeze this, I use an electronic juicer and I get all that out. And then you use half the amount of ginger juice. So I use the kind of juicer you'd use to, for wheatgrass, uh, you really don't want one of those high extraction juicers because it doesn't work for things like ginger and wheatgrass and things like that. So. Um, you know, one of those kind of grinding machines that I'm sure you've seen in the health food stores. Wow, the sunlight is so pretty here. I don't want to be distracting everybody. Okay, so this is what I do. I make a big batch of that and then I freeze it. So this is this amazing liquid gold, um, healthy um, life support. Life support. Um, and you know everybody knows the healing properties of ginger and lemon uh, for the immune system and um, ginger will just kick anything out so I've already given her a neti pot with ginger oil uh, young living ginger oil and a little eucalyptus just to start to clear it you have to be careful only to use a very little bit but it will literally clear you from the inside out so I'm going to go give this to Julia and then I'll check back with her later with you guys just to see how she's feeling and how her um, wellness her road back to wellness is going so let's go and Julia has she's such a good girl she lets me videotape her and be my kind of um, my experiment my living beautiful experiment so <laughs> how you feeling bad bad Aww. okay here's your ginger take a sip of that and I'm like ready to go back to school. <laughs> Crazy. She's ready to go back to school. I love it. But it is soothing, right? Yeah. Okay. That and some matzo ball soup will do the trick. Okay. Check back. Thank you. Love you guys. Bye.